Ah, uh, welcome back. It's the weekend. I've got a new one today. Uh, I'm not going to be doing any credence. Um, just some John Fogarty today. So uh, this is in our set. Uh, we love playing it. Uh, I'm just going to play over the top of uh, the original recording. So um, at the end of it, I'll go through some of the licks and the riffs and the little solos that I do. So here we go. Enjoy, guys. <laughs> That's it for that one. So just an outro solo to finish um, back into the riff four times and then we're done. So that's a great song to play live. Uh, all these songs are great to play live. Um, I really love that one. So um, the riff, the opening riff, um, pretty straightforward. Just on the starting of the, on the G note. There's a little bend. That's, that's the, the riff as I play it. On the record, they'll play, John Fogarty will play, while the rest of the band will come in with. But the way I do it, I'll play the full riff. To the into the verse.
that was just the the verse through the uh, through the chorus. Uh, for that C, young man down the road, uh, I'll play instead of playing just your, your standard C. Uh, I will I'll have my ring finger just on that G note, and it gets a gets a really big chord, really really big uh, C chord. So that little run. So as I'm playing flat, I'm hitting the octave. You can also hit. that little sound pretty swampy uh, so for the solo I'm right up here we're already 12 13 14 15 16th fret I'm on the G string and the E string I don't know if you can see that right there like that so that the way that solo is played um just slide into it You notice I'm giving it a bit of a, a vibrato. It's however you really want to play it. Um, and then into the solo, I kind of I ad lib a little bit, so switch down to my my bridge pickup, and I, I hit both both strings. I've got the G and the B string on the second fret, and you can grab them with two, two fingers if you want. I tend to just use my my index, well, my index, my middle finger um, to do this one. So, what I tend to do is go. That's not how I played it in that recording just then, but I tend to play that one different every single night. Um, so you've got your pen, use your pentatonic in that one. Uh, so your pentatonic would be your E pentatonic. You can use the, the blues as well. So so little licks over those two frets um, in that ad-libbing solo. You can basically, you can play all over the place really, it's, I don't know sort of how else to explain it, but you just sort of, just experiment with the notes, so if you don't want to bend, you can come up to the, instead of going to your, your open E, you can hit the E notes on the 5th fret, so your blues scale, so you can go around there. Notice I'm picking as well with my my middle finger as I'm plucking. So I'm getting it's a little technique I've been using for a little while. So that's um that's how I play, I guess my little licks or my ad living licks around that solo. So, um, yeah, that's that's about it on that song. I try not to get off off track too much, um, but I guess just as a, as a recap, your verse you're going to be playing. <laughs>
So that's your that's your song right there. So with your little your licks and your pentatonic, you're on you're on your way. Um, cool. So that's it for today. Um, have a great weekend, guys. Uh, we'll see you at the next uh, the next gig. Okay. Cool. Take it easy.